Hey, what's up? I'm Ada from DX Daily Podcast, and you gotta check this out. So Drake celebrated the Canadian artist who paved the way for all of us at the opening night of his October World Weekend on Thursday, July 28th. The Six God hosted the all-Canadian North Stars concert at History, the Toronto venue he and Live Nation Canada opened last year, where he brought together over a dozen hip-hop and R&B pioneers. Cardinal Official, Chuck Claire, Socrates, Glenn Lewis, Julie Black, and Maestro Fresh West were among the homegrown stars who hit the stage to deliver short sets of their respective hits. Drake himself joined the fun and performed headlines during Chaos Medley. The OVO boss also had a special surprise up his sleeve, bringing out fellow Canadian superstar Nelly Furtado to dust off old favorites like Promiscuous, Say It Right, and I'm Like a Bird. Before the all-star concert began, Drake graced the mic to pay tribute to those who laid the foundation for both himself and Toronto's hip-hop scene. <laughs> During his speech, he reflected on watching Jay-Z bring out Cardinal Fishall during a show in the city when he was a teen, a moment he says changed his life. This is probably one of, if not the most important uh, event that we've ever done for, uh, for OVO weekend, October World weekend. Uh, I remember when, uh, I remember when I was about like 17 years old, I was in a parking lot and I was watching, uh, I was watching Jay-Z do a show for an event at the time that was called Rock the Caravana. It was like the first time Jay-Z had ever really like come to the city and shown us love. And uh, I was with one of my friends from school and I was in the parking lot and uh, I'll never forget, we were watching and he was bringing out all his new acts. Like I think like Tierra Marie and like all these like different, I don't even know if you guys know who that is. But like, you know, he was bringing out uh, all these different people and then, um, you know, towards the end of the night, he brought out uh, one of the most important people uh, to the city. He brought out a man named Cardinal Fischal. And, um, and for me, that was really, uh, for me, that was really, a moment that unlocked something in my mind, it, 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 it made me realize that, that all this is possible, you know? So I wanna, thank, uh, I wanna thank him, both of them, for that moment. Drake's October World Weekend travels across town at Toronto's Budweiser stage on Friday night, July 29th, where Chris Brown and Little Baby will bring their one of them ones tour to the six. Then on Monday, August 1st, the Honestly Nevermind hitmaker will share the stage with Lil Wayne and Nicki Minaj as part of a highly anticipated Young Money reunion, marking the trio's first performance in almost a decade. The party doesn't stop there though. Drake announced earlier this month he's currently working on bringing OVO Fest around the world in 2023 for the 10th anniversary. But let us know your thoughts in the comment section below. Make sure to hit that subscribe button and notification bell to stay up to date on all of our new videos. And subscribe to the DX Daily Podcast on all streaming platforms. And as always, make sure to keep it all the way locked to hiphopdx.com.